Hi, I'm Rich Harwood. I was just down in Winchester in Clark County releasing our new report, Waving the Community's Flag, which is part of our partnership with the Greater Clark Foundation. I said then, and I still believe now, that when you read the report, you can read it in one of two ways. Either the community's glass is half empty, in which case you believe that the challenges and problems facing the community are overwhelming and too hard to overcome, or you can see the glass is half full, that notwithstanding the challenges, there are some real assets that we can build on to help the community move forward. That's the story I believe that exists now in Winchester and Clark County. We released the report as a call to action, and the next step in terms of taking action is to hold the Public Innovators Lab in April in Winchester and Clark County, where we're gonna to bring together 100 leaders from across the community. I hope you'll be one of them. In two and a half days, we'll spend time with these leaders, helping them think about what does it mean to turn outward toward the community, to make the community the reference point for everything we do, not our own programs, not our own organizations, not our own budgets and, uh, and strategies. Now, that may sound obvious, but we all know it's easier said than done. So many of us now are reflexively turned inward, focused on our own organizations and our own survival. How is it that we can begin to turn outward and make the community truly our reference point for what we do? Then we're gonna move into practical skills and habits that you can develop and put to use in your community immediately following the lab. How is it, for instance, that you can authentically engage people in the community so that we're focused on our shared aspirations for moving forward and that we can bridge some of the divides that exist within the community? How is it that we can develop strategies that have a real chance to succeed and take into account the capacity we have to move things forward as opposed to creating wish lists that sound good and create false hope and actually don't create the kinds of change that we're looking for? And how is it that we can build the leaders, the networks, the norms, the ways of doing business together so that we can actually come together and move the community forward? You know, a community divided can't move forward together. And the chance for Winchester and Clark County right now is how can we come together and make community a common enterprise? One of the first steps we'll be taking to make that happen is this lab in April. I hope you'll join us. I hope I'll see you there and I hope we can start to move the community forward together. Thanks so much.